In a corner of southwest London, Fulham to be precise, yet another French Revolution is taking place. This time in the kitchens of this French gourmet restaurant. And cakes are involved. One in ten people in the UK has diabetes or is indeed pre-diabetic, and a large proportion of them don't even realise it. This puts massive stress on our already strained National Health Service, especially given the traumas of the pandemic. But did you know our taste for exquisite foods is on the up? Both at home and since being released from the rigours of lockdown, eating out. But as our taste buds have been educated, Frankly, our diet has become terrible and puts us far more at risk of becoming diabetic. People generally believe that diets and diabetic-friendly food are tasteless and bland. So is there a way of delivering gourmet standard tasty food whilst observing some diabetic-friendly rules to curb the spread of this all-too-prevalent epidemic? Arathan, the owner of L'Amour, and his chef Tony think so. I'm diabetic, I love the great food, and I'm an owner of gourmet French restaurant in Fulham. I want to bring these three elements together for me and others in a diabetic friendly gourmet menu. I use my 25 years of cooking experience and ingredient advice from the Diabetic Charity. They're about to launch what they believe to be Europe's first diabetic friendly gourmet menu. We hope to produce delicious and tasty foods suitable for everyone including Diabetics. And an international diabetic charity agrees. Initiatives that seek to improve the lives and health of people living with diabetes is to be commended and encouraged. Healthy eating is an important part of the management and treatment of diabetes in order to maintain quality of life and general good health. So we at Diabetes Research and Wellness Foundation are absolutely delighted to support the Moore Restaurant in Fulham in the launch of their diabetes friendly gourmet menu. Even a local doctor's surgery is keen to promote this menu to their patients at risk of diabetes. So at this festive time of mass consumption of potentially diabetically challenging food, perhaps our New Year's resolution should be to pop along to L'Amour in Fulham for some healthy yet tasty food and cakes.